I am officially married. I'm officially, officially married, y'all. I cannot believe it. Hi guys, welcome back to my vlog. Oh my gosh, like my camera wants to have a low battery the minute I turn it on, but the, right before this, it had full battery. Today is Tuesday, welcome back to another vlog. Long time no see you guys. Ooh, a lot has been going on. I have a full face of makeup because I just got done filming my luxury haul. I'm so excited, I hope you guys enjoyed it because by the time you're watching this vlog, it already came out. Um, today's Tuesday, so it's going up tomorrow. I just got done filming. I will edit tonight. But yeah, I just got done doing that, so I didn't get a chance to take my makeup off yet. Um, we're 18 right now. It's late. It's later on in the day because I just got a late start to filming, and I just got done. And I have a meeting with our wedding planner because you guys, next week, Next week, we are getting married. We are getting married, married, married. Can't believe my wedding is next week. Like, I feel like for those who have been watching me, following me, I feel like I've been saying I've been getting married for a long time. And then like now, I'm like actually getting married. Like, it's so crazy. It's, it's just so surreal. I keep saying it's so surreal. So yeah, I will try to keep up with my vlogs, but as you guys can imagine, I am super duper busy, which is why I didn't film or give you guys a vlog on Mother's Day. Um, let's just sit down and talk real quick. I had to sit down, but as y'all can see, I probably, I'm probably i pretty sure you guys probably seen it in the thumbnail somewhere. But this week or this past week, I mean, it has been very just traumatic for us. Like, especially, I guess for me, because uh, I'm just like, I have so much going on. Okay, so obviously, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you probably already know this, but if not, our car got totaled. We were on our way to the airport. I was driving one of the cars. My fiance was in the other car. So we always tail each other to the airport so that we could ride back together. You guys know we do Toro, so we were getting ready to drop off her car at the airport for Toro. I was at the gas station filling up the car. Babe was already ahead of me on his way to the airport when he was hit by this driver head on. I'm gonna put some pictures up, but you guys can see the car like, uh, he walked away with minor injuries, but I'm thanking God everyone was overall okay because um, it was a wife and her husband and then my fiance. So an SUV smacked our car and totaled it out. I mean, we had a Corolla, you guys know. That car didn't have a chance. Like, against an SUV? No, ma'am, like, totaled out, it's gone. You know, I didn't have it for a year. You know, that's the thing about Atlanta. Like, I love Atlanta, but y'all, a car accident, I hate to say, is inevitable. You just have to pray whenever you do get into one, you'll be okay. Nine times out of 10, you're gonna see a car accident. Actually, 10 out of 10, you're gonna see a car accident on the highway. That's just how it is out here. And uh, yeah, my little car is gone, y'all. Um, thankfully, we have the other one. So that's still on Toro doing his thing. But, you know, on the flip side of that, we did have to cancel our trips and lose out on, you know, the income that would've came from that. So I was just like, a week before our wedding? Really? Really? A week before our wedding, our car gets totaled? Like, why? Why now? Like, what's going on? Okay, so that's that. Um, yeah, just going through the motions, guys. Like I said, it's been a long, long weekend or a long week. And it's not getting any shorter because this week is going to be the final touches of getting everything ready for the wedding. And then next week, everyone is arriving and we're getting married. So it's a lot. The progress with the wedding is we're done with the seating chart. Um, we spent all day doing the seating chart. Babe really came through and got his little spreadsheet on and like really put everyone where we wanted them to go. So yeah, we did our best with all the names. So we got that done. But I have some stuff in the background that I wanna share with you guys. Stuff that I have been purchasing and accumulating for my bridal shower or wedding. Let me turn this down some, cause it's so high. Okay, there we go. So I ordered some party favors off of Etsy. First of all, the packaging is so cute. Look at the packaging, like so freaking cute. So cute. And inside are my party favors and 
they are candles y'all seen these candles around they're like the little cute aesthetic candles um with the bubble but i found some tiny ones that i can pass out as favors mm, i got pumpkin spice so it smells like fall i'm not gonna lie like it smells like fall time in this box like so cute so so cute so i got a bunch of these to set out um, on the table so cute i will link the etsy seller below to their shop to where i got these uh favors from i just thought it was so cute and you guys know i have a boho type theme to my bridal shower so everything's like really neutral and you know browns nudes neutral so really cute i got another package from etsy it came in an amazon box but um it's from etsy and these are my lollipops i ordered a bunch of these lollipops i'm going to show you how they look look how cute they are i don't know if y'all can tell but they have gold flakes in them and they're on this clear stick oh so freaking cute i low-key wanted to open them because i just don't know about this gold wrapping but i know for sanitary purposes <laughs> you probably need to keep these wrapped but i just think they're so freaking cute i will link her below and then she also gave two free lollipops as thank yous which i thought was so cute and then i did order this from amazon to go with my lollipops i ordered this stand it is acrylic stand it's kind of like in the shape of a heart but it can come apart it has these little holes i put this together already it did not come like this it had a plastic film on it the screws were separate like i had to put it together but it was very simple but it's just like double stand that you can put your lollipops in so it can go like this right like that so it just stands and you just pop them all in and let people take one as they go so <clears throat> oh my throat y'all i just can't talk last thing i got is actually from amazon as well and i'm obsessed with it like look at my bridal robe i got my bridal robe this is so funny because let me tell y'all this real quick so i got these hangers from I don't know if you guys remember my vlog from like last year like a whole year ago i got these um black velvet hangers but i got them from tj maxx or home goods and i almost took them back because i was like oh it says mrs on it like i knew i was getting married but i was like mm, like i'm not a mrs yet so i don't know why i got these hangers like i want to just play back black ones and unknowingly i'm telling you unknowingly i literally just draped this um bridal robe on this hanger and i just noticed today just now that it said mrs on it so that was so freaking cute just just the universe and god speaking to me y'all i swear so i got this robe i'm gonna try it on because it was literally only 20 bucks I'm telling y'all don't sleep on amazon when it comes to y'all bridal stuff because a lot of this stuff you can get for cheap okay my camera's on this tripod because i want y'all to see the whole thing but let me see if I can put y'all down. This is like real life vlogging right here. But this is it. So freaking cute with the sleeves. I love the long sleeves. Um, so freaking cute. Like leaving it open with the sleeves and stuff. So cute. It's long like I'm literally stepping on it. But cute. Ah, I am obsessed with it for only 20 bucks. Yes, $20. Yeah, my stuff from Instacart has came. I just put the fruit away and I got some green mix. I got the green wise green mix from Publix. It looks like this. Um, I'm about to make a salad, like I said. Or did I mention I was making a salad? I don't know. You guys see my Mother's Day thing? Macy made me a Mother's Day flower. I know some of you guys, I was watching like on TikTok about how like the moms like, I don't want no daggone paper mache. <laughs> like, happy Mother's Day. And it's just like a thing, but I just thought that this was so cute. Like, I'm still enjoying little stuff like this for Macy because I don't expect to have no more kids. So, 
you know, and our other two daughters are 11 and 12, so I don't, they're like older, so I don't get stuff like this anymore. So I'm going to embrace it for now. I like to use these tortilla strips. They were out of them. This is like an old pack, obviously. I only have about this much left, which is hardly anything at all. So I have my tortilla chips, the cilantro lime ones. Love them, so I'm just gonna mix those together with my salad because I really love these. They're the tortilla tricolor restaurant styled um, strips, but they were sold out. You guys, my mom will be here Sunday, this Sunday. Um, so that's another reason why, like I said, I will try to vlog next week, but you guys have the luxury haul and then you guys have this vlog. But after that, ciao. It might be a little minute because I'm gonna be recovering from the wedding and family are gonna still be here, so just bear with me. This is like my Chipotle salad that I made. So good. I used to make I make this all the time and I just it's so good. It's so good. So I'm about to eat real quick before I get Macy and then I'll come back on camera after. Hey guys. <laughs> it is days later. Um, I can't remember when's the last time I actually filmed. I was planning on having a vlog out on Sunday, this past Sunday. Um, but things didn't go as planned and I've been super busy as you guys can imagine. Hope you guys can imagine that I'm super busy with wedding stuff. I am getting married this Friday, today's Monday. I can't be on the camera. Actually, I can be on the camera. It's just the editing that gets in the way. Like I can record all day. The editing takes the most time and that's what I don't have time for. So whenever this vlog comes out, I have no idea when this vlog will come out. I'm hoping by Wednesday, you know, maybe I can get some editing done tonight. Hopefully, um, you know, I'll stay up late and try to edit. <sighs> My hairstylist is calling y'all, hold on. Hello? Sorry guys, I got cut off. I had to speak to the hairstylist. <laughs> y'all, I'm telling you, every like couple of minutes, I can't get a break because I'm always having to talk to somebody. My phone's ringing. It's just a little crazy. I mean, rightfully so, I'm, we're getting married Friday. So there's a lot of moving pieces and a lot going on right now. But um, I just wanna come on camera real quick because I need to go to Sephora. I need to run a couple of errands really quickly. It is 5.10, I waited a little late, but that's because like, I didn't really wanna go out in traffic. Like I should've left like early this morning, but I honestly was like getting all of my stuff together as far as like cleaning the house, um, you know, doing the laundry, washing our bedding. I was doing stuff like that because we're staying at a hotel and I wanted to come back to a clean house. So I know once Wednesday comes, I'm not gonna be able to do any cleaning or anything. And plus once Wednesday come, I'm gonna be going to the hotel and stuff. So I wanted to handle that stuff first. And then now I'm starting to do the last minute stuff for my bridal shower, which is also Wednesday. So yeah, um, we're gonna go to Sephora. <laughs> And then we are going to pack the bridal stuff. We're gonna, um, I'm gonna have you guys pack the bridal gifts with me. And then, yeah, that's probably it for this vlog. I wanna film my bridal shower. I just don't know when I'll be able to get that out to you guys. Um, so, yeah, um, we'll go to Sephora now. Hey yeah, guys, I'm back in the same spot. It's later. I know I said I would take y'all to Sephora with me, but to be honest with you, I don't know why I said that because I knew I would be scrambling, running around with the, like a chicken with my head cut off and looking crazy. And y'all would just been mad because I would have bad angles. And y'all would have been like, what is this Brittany? So let me just explain to something to y'all real quick. I went out to go get my bridesmaids gifts late. I know I kind of procrastinated with this one and I hate procrastinating, which led me to not get what I wanted at all like nothing was in stock everything that i planned on getting for my bridesmaids um gifts were was out of stock so i just had to make do with what i had and i'm gonna show you what i'm putting together so i don't know if y'all can see so this is a sample of my bridal box oh my my nails missing i'm taking them off but this is a, a sample of my bridal boxes um this is what it looks like this is not exactly what i was plan on doing but you know I had to make do so this is what I have for the first one 
and um, the only thing that is missing is this ribbon which I'm gonna tie after sorry the camera keeps going dark but it's about almost 8 o'clock right now and the Sun has gone down or it's going down so yeah um, I am getting started on my second one with the robe and scrunchy that's one of my bridesmaids scrunchy and then their robes are in here as well um, I got these shoe boxes from um, Amazon they were like 75 bucks for eight of them which was a good deal because they actually can fit a pair of shoes so yeah I just got this I got this idea off of TikTok from a few ladies um, it's a bunch of ladies on TikTok that I've seen do this but the most recent one that I looked at was Nathalie Nunez. I always trip up her name. Nathalie Nunez, I believe. Hopefully I'm saying it right. But she has a YouTube channel as well. And she has a TikTok. And I went on her TikTok and I was like, girl, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to copy. And then I'm going to like at you. Because this is such a good idea. And so um, the only difference is like... What I've been seeing, people print their names on the actual... Um, case but my bridesmaids already have their names on their robes so I just did it that way I went on Zazzle I made these custom letters so they look like this and each one has like a picture of me and each bridesmaid and then I wrote a letter for them on the back so that'll just like go like this let me tie the night let me let me let me fix it up for y'all, at least one of them, so y'all can see what I'm doing. Sorry for the reflection, but this is how it looks. And then the card will be placed like right here. And it says, thank you for being my bridesmaid. And then place it right here. Like I said, robe, hair tie, face mask. This is a coconut face mask. I honestly got this only because of the color. I got each of them a Gucci bloom. It smells so good, so. You just slide it out, just slide it out like this. Oh my gosh, it smells, mm, it smells so good. It's like a floral scent. Oh my gosh, let me see if they have the notes on it. Probably not. I have these baby breaths that I got from the grocery store a long time ago, like a couple weeks ago. And they're still fresh, but I'm going to use them inside of my bridal boxes because, you know, instead of throwing them away, I wanted to add some floral to it. So I'm going to add that into the box as well. Candles, they do smell like apple cookie. It will smell so good. So I'm going to add one of those to each of their boxes. Like this is the robes. I love them because they're not like the regular robes, like just the regular satin robes. I didn't want that. I kind of wanted these ones. Print ones, lace print or whatever. All right, so I'm going to finish up and then I'll show you what I have done. I guess. <laughs> it is tuesday so i don't even know when's the last time i filmed but if you're watching this now then i am finally married i'm officially married i'm officially officially married y'all i cannot believe it it's been days so i don't even remember the last time i filmed but um yeah <laughs> like so much has happened obviously as you can tell i'm still recuperating from <laughs> this weekend or this past week because so much has happened you guys and as y'all can tell my voice is going out i want to apologize in advance because you guys i literally did not film like i didn't film anything like i have a lot of footage from my phone but as far as like the camera goes i did not pick up my camera i thought that i had so much time to vlog and I don't know what I was thinking because that was nowhere near true. The amount of things that I had to get done, the amount of people, the amount, it was just crazy. So I do apologize in advance. I don't have actual wedding footage, but I do have um, a lot of footage that I posted on my Instagram. I know you guys don't have social media. You guys need social media because that's where you're going to find all the footage. Um, so yeah, for those who are following me on Instagram or TikTok, you guys have seen almost everything. So yeah, thank you guys so much for um, commenting and wishing us well with, and giving us your well wishes. For those who don't have social media, I do apologize. Like y'all gonna have to wait until I get like the professional footage or something, cause y'all missed out. <laughs> 
Y'all missed out, I apologize, because I thought I would have so much time to film. I don't know what I was thinking though, that was crazy. But yes, you guys, I'm officially married and I am gonna be sharing with you guys some wedding aftermath of like my bridal shower and my wedding. I still have stuff to share with you guys and to show you like gifts and all that. Like I do wanna do that in this vlog and throughout the rest of my vlogs. So yeah, that's gonna be exciting. Right now, I'm getting ready to head out. I have a lot of errands to run. We're back to it, you guys. It's a regular, degular, back to the scheduling program because I have a lot of stuff to do, you guys. I have so many errands, but I'm gonna try to get done what I can today and tomorrow. And also, I still have my wig on. I ended up getting a wig installed for my wedding. I don't do wigs. <laughs> I do not do wigs, but I decided to just keep this on until this week at least. Um, but yeah, this is coming off soon because I just, I just don't, I just saw that one. But oh yeah, guys, now that I'm married, I can show you guys my actual wedding ring because like I didn't get a chance to like show you guys. And like y'all know I was itching, itching to show you guys what my ring actually looked like. Y'all know my ring came from Cartier, and I'm gonna show you what it looks like. This was my dream wedding band, okay? This is my dream wedding band, so let me show you guys. So this is my dream wedding band, y'all. I've been wanting this ring for such a long time. It says Cartier on it with the one diamond. I am just obsessed with it. You guys probably can't tell, but it is um, rose gold. I don't know if y'all can tell. It is a pink gold. It's not like the regular gold. It is pink gold, but um, it's European, so their pink gold is not actually like bright pink. It's actually like just, you know, slightly pink, which I love. So yeah, this is my wedding band. But yeah, it feels so good to be filming. I missed you guys so much, and I know this isn't necessarily like the whole wedding vlog, but you guys will see like wedding footage or like the aftermath of the wedding because I have a lot of like stuff to show you guys and share with you guys. And plus, if you have followed me on Instagram, like I said, you have seen everything. Anyway, so yeah, I will be back once I get in the car. All right, I'm back, you guys. I went into the court and I didn't film in there. Obviously, I didn't film in there, but... We got our marriage certificate with the seal, with the seal. I'm so happy, y'all. Like, ah, I'm so happy. We are about to go into Target because I'm hungry. I want to look at Target. Like I said, I haven't been to Target in such a long time. I don't know if I told you guys, but I'm changing my bed. I cannot stand to look at my bed anymore. Like, I don't know. Like, I, I feel like I've outgrown the whole, like, velvety, like, gold and green like uh, I just hate the bedroom in our bathroom needs a huge makeover so I am selling our bed I'm selling the bench that goes with it and I am looking for a new bed it's 406 like uh time went by time went by like so fast it's already 406 I might have to take this lace down like tomorrow but yeah I'm covering it up because it's so white They got fireworks. I keep forgetting Memorial Day is coming up. Is it me or I feel like Target is just not it for their home decor anymore? Like, they still have the same plants and stuff. Same plants, same bases, like, from months ago. This is so cute. I would love to get this for Macy and put it in the backyard. Look at these, they have a nine, these are cute. Look at these. Yeah, this one, matches cute. <gasps> they have a matching with leggings. All right guys, I'm back home. Um, I just went to pick up Macy from school and now I'm home. Don't pay attention to our bed, it's a mess right now, but it doesn't matter because I'm getting rid of this freaking ugly green bed. Yeah, I'm gonna end the vlog because I have a part two of like this whole wedding recap on Sunday um, because I'm getting back to filming y'all. Like, 
I'm pouring my all into filming and my YouTube and content creating because I felt like I was on track. I sound redundant saying this over and over again, but um, I felt like I was on track with, you know, like my YouTube journey and influencing and then the wedding came. And so I was like, you know, taking all that time to plan. My mind was just somewhere else at all times. And then now that it's gone, I'm just like, I can get back to Brittany. So I have another vlog for you guys on Sunday and I want to start posting Wednesdays and Sundays now. And then when I have like a random video, I'll post it on Friday. But for the most part, I'll do Wednesdays and Sundays always. But I'm going to insert some wedding footage here at the end. Keep in mind, it might be vertical just because I filmed it on my phone. Thank you guys so much for supporting me and rock with me. I love you guys. I'm so sorry I couldn't record everything, but hopefully, like I said, I have something to show you guys. If you're not subscribed, make sure you subscribe to my channel and click the notification bell so you're alerted whenever I post a new video. <clears throat> my voice is going out. <laughs> I had a crazy week, y'all. Yeah, guys, I will see you in my next vlog. Bye. I'm